we begin tonight with the Ogmogee Police Chief positively identifying remains found in a river in Ogmogee as Mark and Billy Chastain, Mike Sparks and Alex Stevens. We told you these men left on bicycles October 9th and didn't return home. Today during a news conference, the police chief said the men all had gunshot wounds and their bodies had been dismembered. Two News Oklahoma senior reporter Justin Ayer has the latest from police. The Okmulgee Police Chief calling this a violent act. The Deep Fork River to my left in Okmulgee, he says, was clearly a dump site. Now he says his main focus is figuring out who killed these four men. It's a very violent event, so I can't say that I've never worked anything like it, but um, it's right up there at the top. Four men dismembered and now positively identified as Mark Chastain, Billy Chastain, Mike Sparks, and Alex Stevens. Spotted Friday evening by a passerby in the river by the Sharp Road Bridge. It's very, very shocking. Um, it's very sad. Police Chief Joe Prentice during Monday's news conference. We believe the men planned to commit some type of criminal act when they left the residence on West 6th Street. That belief is based on information supplied by a witness who reports they were invited to go with the men to quote unquote hit a lick big enough for all of them. Chief Prentice says Joe Kennedy, the owner of two nearby salvage yards, is considered a person of interest since evidence of a violent event was discovered on an adjoining property. Mr. Kennedy was reported missing Saturday night and may be suicidal. I looked up Kennedy and called him. I'm sorry. But the person you called has a voice mailbox that has not been set up yet. Just over two hours after Monday's news conference, Chief Prentice says they found Kennedy's car abandoned behind a business in Morris, Oklahoma. The police chief says one of the reasons it took so long to identify the victims is because whenever there's water involved in a crime scene, it makes it difficult to identify evidence. In Oak Mulgee, Justin Air, 2 News, Oklahoma.